clicking DSLR like pictures is like a dream for mobile phone users. We are not getting that good camera that we can click DSLR like pictures. But yes, in this video, I'll show you how to click DSLR like pictures or you can edit your normal pictures and make it a DSLR like picture in your phone only. Hey, how are you guys? Your mate Ruthik here. So now let's kick off with the video. As you can see here, here's the camera app. I'll be clicking a DSLR like picture in this app. Here's an option of lens blur. I'll use it to click a DSLR like picture. And uh, let me click the picture of this object only. All I have to do is just a little sc scroll after clicking the picture. And that scroll will detect the image, the object which I want to click. And it will render image like this. And you can see a blur effect is being seen. So with this app you can do that. And this app is the Google camera. Yes, it's Google camera. Let me show you it once again. It's here. And just like I did it a little faster. So I can't see that much blur in, in this one. Let me try it once again. And here you can see that blur immediately comes to the image so you can click the DSLR like pictures with it and second thing which comes to my mind when I think of DSLR like pictures is the after focus pro and yes you can use it to select your images from your phone and edit them the way you want it to be and I have to select the focus area the white one is for focus and you can see I have selected a BG, BG means background. The red part is the selected area and that selected area will be in focus. All other area will lose its focus. Let me just quickly do this selecting and I'll catch you guys after it. And you can see here, I have selected the area which is to be focused. Now I have just to proceed further. And you can see that blur effect can be seen. I haven't selected it that accurately, you can see. But if you select the image right in the right way and accurately, at, it focuses actually very well. And you can also go for bokeh. You see, it, it has added a little bokeh in the picture. I can increase the blur intensity. And I can change the blur to motion blur also. That's a really good feature about it. I can even fade the background. I can, I can give filter to background and foreground both. For foreground, you can see it's the filter for foreground only. For background, this is the filter changing for background. And for the whole also. And this is a really cool app. Let me show you a few images I edited with this app and you can see this picture is edited with After Focus Pro only and this one also and I'll be showing you the actual image and this one was the actual image you can see the difference you can download After Focus from the Play Store and it's available here I'm using the Pro version which is ad free and also you can look for Google camera so guys these apps are not paying me anything that's all a way to bring out some good thing to my audience to you guys and you guys are everything for my channel I hope you liked it keep supporting hit the like button if you like the video hit the subscribe button to catch me up in my next videos thanks for watching namaste